Our current department is fortified and stimulated not just by excellent uh, teachers and instructors, but uh, with a curriculum that I think over the years has proven to be extremely valuable to our students. You know, you're going to play everything from like snare drum to, you know, rimba, cell phone. Frank Epstein is going to come in and teach just a couple cymbal classes. So we have like the Tiffany rep class where we do orchestral excerpts on timpani. We also have a hand drumming class, really valuable. We do like Cuban and Brazilian hand drumming. We have electronic percussion class where you'll learn to like program some, some beats. And then we also do a drum set class every other year. It's like really high level in here, but I love it. Like they expect a lot from you. You expect a lot from the school as well. We want a student who presents a repertoire that speaks to the current level of, of performance that we seek. And our standards these days are very high. Percussion Ensemble has been my baby for quite a while, and we've done some exquisite programs and concerts over the years. The first time that I came here was three years ago, and I went with a friend to a BSO concert, and I was like just amazed by the hall and the orchestra and everything. And I didn't believe that maybe like after that or three years I, would, I was going to be playing there. Like I, I was sitting where my teachers usually sit, so that was basically my favorite experience. The BSO connection uh, for this school is huge, at least for the brass and percussion departments where the majority of its faculty come directly from the BSO and also retired members of the BSO. The connection is rich, it's important, it's critical and I think our students uh, benefit a lot from having a major orchestra perform four or five times a week within one block of the school. Oh, the studio at NEC, you know, it's kind of notorious in the rest of the building for the, the couch hang. If you come down here at any point, there's usually like five to 20 people sitting out in that hallway, <laughs> like eating lunch. And uh, you know, our professors will come down and, and hang out with us too. And so I think it's a really close knit group. Uh, we all help each other a lot. Like if we're playing something and we're like struggling with it, we know that we could ask any of the other players that are around here. We're really close to each other and even with other like studios like the bass studio they're always here with us. Uh, the strings also like the violin they're always here with us. So I think it's like a really close community. We understand each other, we respect each other as a player, as a person. We're just like a big family. It's interesting because we're all going out for the same jobs and auditions but uh, it never feels competitive in a, in a cutthroat way. It's, it's just very supportive. I feel like I'm learning so much as a, a percussionist, as a musician, as a person. Uh, I couldn't imagine a better place to be. I mean, the teachers that we have are amazing, and the fact that you can just go across the street to hear them playing every week. And if you look back in the years, like all the percussionists that came here or go here right now, they're doing great, they all have jobs, or they're really close to get one, so I think it's the right place to be.